Okay, hey YouTube, how y'all doing? So, I've been trying to make this video for the longest. And something always comes up. And I don't have the editing software that I used to have. So, I'm just going to run through it. If I mess up, I mess up. Hey. So, okay, let me start from the beginning. I wanted to own a Reborn Dial Kit. Or not a dial kit a reborn dial but I saw the prices and I really wasn't feeling it so I said well if I get the kit you know I can paint it myself and that be that I'm artistic I'm creative I did all the decorations for my wedding so hey you know I decorated for the church it's not a big deal but uh, <laughs> this takes a different level of patience of skill that I have not worked on yet so the first kit I ever got I did a video of that and that was from Bonneful Baby the real born Skya asleep I'm not even gonna show that kit because I painted it and I stripped it and I painted it and I stripped it and I did it so much that one time I put some varnish on it to um make the paint stick because i was using glass and tile medium but i made it stick too well then the paint won't come off so that was the last time that i did any painting for that and i said you know what i'm just going to give me a kit and find an artist and have the artist paint it so that's my plans I, I talked to a couple artists and I found one that I really really like she's from her nursery is juice box nursery and when I say her painting her dolls are oh my goodness I just can't even find the words so I when I when I first contacted her, I only had one of my dream kits. And as we were talking, I ordered another one. So I was supposed to send them off to her. But with everything that's going on, that's going to have to be postponed for now. So I want to introduce to you my two. I have three, three dream dial kits. Right now I have two in my possession. Um, the third one, I might wait till next year to get her i mean if it's meant for me to get then i get if not hey say la vie so okay first i want to introduce you to camille camille and i were born the same year this is my very first baby doll ever when i say <laughs> this was my baby this still is my baby her name is camille and i just i can't part with camille I've moved several times. My mother's basement flooded. We've had different things where I've lost um, items and things like that. I had my stuff in storage when I moved from my apartment back home before I moved into my house. And this is a lot of things that happen. And I never, ever, as you can see, lost Camille. <laughs> Nothing, Camille is here to stay. Um, let me move this stuff out the way. Now, the first kit that I saw that I really wanted and I had to have was the Noah Asleep by Reva Schick. But I got it and hmm, it really, I just, I didn't like it as much in person as I did online. And then the kit had bubbles in it and it had extra vinyl and it just, it was bad. So I sent that one back. For this one in exchange for this one. And this is Erin by Adri Stoet. No, no, no. Yeah, that's right. Erin by Adri Stoet. Um, I have her all <laughs> bundled up like she's a real baby. But I just sit and I cuddle with her and with Millicent. Her name is Ella. So I named her Ella. And she has on a onesie. I even have her on a little diaper. If you can see the diaper through there. But yeah, I just put her together as normal. She's even weighted. And I did. I purchased. Um, like I said, I was going to do the kits myself. 
But after that first kid got messed up, I said, no, no, no. I will not be spending a hundred and something dollars on a kit only to mess it up. So, hey, um, I have my glass beads, which I waited. I even have my polyfill. I even had little things where I was using to dab the paint. But anyway, this is Ella, like I said. And I'm going to get her painted oh, soon. I don't know when, though. Oh, and I went to the Dollar Tree. And I got some Paw Patrol. Purple is my favorite color. Will it focus? Yeah, there she goes. I don't know the name of this dog, but I know it's Paw Patrol. And she fits a modified pacifier. Her pacifier is um, cut just a little bit smaller than Millicent. And Millicent, this is my other baby. She is the Ivy Jane by Melody Hess, limited edition. And I have number 267 out of 500. And, of course, I have her bundled up, too. And I have her in a little gingerbread onesie. Have her head wrapped up because I find that the vinyl is cold, like, against my skin. So, until I get her painted and all that other good stuff, I just rather have her, you know, bundled up. And like, like I said, she is weighted too. Um, she has on a diaper and a onesie as well. Just a plain little onesie. You can see her diaper through there. All right. And then I have a lot of clothes for them. <clears throat> considering I'm very new to the hobby. I went to um <laughs> I went to a, a thrift store, Goodwill, and I bought some baby clothes and I went to another thrift shop and it's exclusively for baby things. It's called Baby Resale. Next time I go in there I'm going to do a video for it. But um they have a lot of good stuff like this receiving blanket, this one, and this one. They were all in a pack for $3.99. And then this receiving blanket and the other one, so it was two. That was like $2.99. Um... Now, Millicent wears zero to three months, and she fits that perfectly. And I got her this, and Ella wears newborn perfectly. So, I got her a couple onesies, and this is for Millicent. That's a three to six months, but she can fit it. Excuse me. And this is a three months, so that's for Millicent too. And I have a bag <laughs> full of goodies. Now this baby resale shop, they have a um, dollar rack. So when you see the tag and you see like a red mark through it, that means it was only a dollar. So I got this, and the reason I have them separated is because these I washed already. The ones in the bags, tag still on. I haven't had a chance to clean. But um, this is zero to three months. That's for Millicent. And newborn, this is for Ella. This is a cute little onesie. And it even has the the thing where you could flip it over so they don't need mittens, scratch mittens. And this is for newborn. This is for Ella. This is for Ella. 
I remember because I stood up there and put it <laughs> put it together. And like I said, all of these things are a dollar. Like you can't beat that with a stick. Um, this was three fifty, but boom, got it for a dollar. And this one is for millicents because zero to three months. And this one is for Millicent, zero to three months. Got it for a dollar. And this is for Millicent. This was only 75 cents. Then I was at the Dollar Tree. And I purchased, I like Oscar the Grouch because he was grouchy and nobody understood him, but he had a good heart, just rough outside. So even though I don't have any boys, I like Oscar the Grouch and green. I love green, green and purple. And then I have one big bird. These were from the Dollar Tree. And this was from the Dollar Tree. A pack of size three diapers. It says Looney Tunes. I got two packs of these, and they fit Millicent. They're a little bit too big for Ella. Ella, I got her diapers from Walmart, and I just got the little cheapy pack of newborn diapers for her yeah so those are my girls and these are a few items that i have i have more i believe i purchased a lot more things but they're scattered around the house and mixed in with the um with the laundry and different things like that so yeah if you have any questions Feel free to comment down below. Please do not be rude. Yes, I do know these are baby dolls. But for my own personal reasons, I choose to have them. So, if you don't have anything nice to say, move along. Nobody's forcing you to watch my videos. Alright, everybody else, I will talk to you all later. Have a good night.